The late great astrophysicist Stephen Hawking believed with more than 100 billion stars in our galaxy, the odds are pretty good that aliens exist. And he's not alone. Every day, people across Canada report seeing a UFO. And while most can be identified as CTV's Janet Dirks reports, some things just can't be explained. I got it. Oh, my gosh. Oh. What the hell? That strange light in the sky is one of 1,100 UFO sightings in Canada last year. According to the annual survey released by Ufology Research of Manitoba, there are at least three such sightings in the country every day. UFO reports are still a thing. People are reporting them in greater and greater numbers every year. Montreal is Canada's UFO capital, with 74 sightings reported last year, followed by Toronto, then Vancouver. It's not that these cities are on an extraterrestrial highway. It's a matter of population, says the report's author. If a tree's falling in the forest, you need somebody to hear it. So if there's a UFO in the sky, the more people around to see it, the more reports you get. None of the sightings match the drama of the X-Files. The truth is out there. But something was out there, according to 10 campers in Quebec, who reported a triangular object that hovered and then flew off. One of them drew the scene. In Oshawa, a wildlife photographer captured an odd-shaped disc in the sky. This scientist says people should be critical, but still open-minded. There's a few that really just get me scratching my head, saying, what could it have been? The survey says of the 1,100 sightings, only 8% are unexplained and that can be whittled down to 1% of so-called high-quality unknowns. In fact, none of these cases uh, you know, shout that aliens are here, but what they do say is that people are reporting things and maybe science should take a closer look at some of them. Since the survey began nearly 30 years ago, more than 19,000 Canadians have reported seeing something strange in the sky that makes them think we're not alone. Janet Dirks, CTV News, Calgary.